Alright, how you guys doing today? This is Mr. Muscarella coming at you and in this video I'm going to show you how to convert between decimal form and the DMS or degrees minute second form using the TI-84 graphing calculator. So the first thing that we're going to do is we're going to convert 21.256 degrees to the degrees minute seconds form. So go ahead and get out your TI-84 graphing calculator and let's follow along. Now to start this what we're going to do first is have a little bit of a discussion about the mode because the mode is very important here. So if you hit the mode button, what I want you to do right now is notice that we are in radian mode. So if you're in radian mode, this is how we're going to do this type of problem. Go ahead and get out of radian mode by hitting second and mode. In radian mode, you're simply going to type in 21.256. Now notice we're not going to add the degree symbol on here and that is because we are in radian mode. Now the next thing that we want to do, because we want to convert this to degrees, minutes, and seconds, and check this out. If you look right here above the apps button on your TI-84 graphing calculator, you see the word angle. And that is where we want to get into. So go ahead and hit second apps. Now if you notice down on number four, you see this little triangle and then DMS. And what that does, we're going to go ahead and hit enter and we're going to take that 21.256 and convert that to degrees, minutes, and seconds. Boom. There we are. Now, wait a second, Mr. Muscarello. How come we didn't have to put on the degree symbol? Well, if you would have done that, you would have ended up with a slightly different answer because of the mode that we're in. So check this out. If we would have typed in 21.256 and we add our little degree symbol, so again, this is right here in the apps menu, by hitting second and then apps. Notice the first thing in that angle menu is degree. So if we would have added that in there and then done the same thing, the DMS, notice we would have gotten a completely different result. However, if we would go back to our mode and change our mode over to degree, then watch what happens. So I'm gonna take that same number again 21.256 degrees and change that to DMS and this time notice I get 21 degrees 15 minutes and 21.6 seconds so here's where you have to be really careful if you're in radian mode 21.256 do not add the degree symbol however if you do want to add the degree symbol make sure that you are in degree mode I know it's a small detail, but it's an important detail that will allow you to get the correct answer or the incorrect answer if you make a mistake. So that's all you have to do to convert decimal degrees into degrees, minutes, and seconds. Now next, we're going to go ahead and convert this 21 degrees, 15 minutes, 21.6 seconds to a decimal in degrees. Again, we're going to use our TI-84 graphing calculator to help us out with this. Alright, so now when we go ahead and convert 21 degrees, 15 minutes, 21.6 seconds into a decimal form, we're going to have to figure out where these symbols come from. The degree symbol, the minute symbol, and then the second symbol. Now both the degree and the minute symbol, they're going to be found over here again. They're going to be in the apps menu, or actually the angle menu, which you get to by hitting second and then angle. So that one's pretty straightforward. Now to get the 21.6, to get that second symbol, that's all the way down here by the memory button, right above the plus button. So you have to actually hit the alpha key because notice it's in a light green. So you got to hit the alpha key in order to get the quotation marks for the seconds. Once you do that, you hit enter and boom, there you are, 21.256. But wait, hold on. What mode are we in? Let's check that real fast. Ooh, we're in radian mode. So we're in radian mode and we got that. So let's change our mode to degree and see what happens. So we're going to change that to degree. Our mode is now in degree. And then I'm going to do the same thing again. Now, so here's a little trick. All you do is just move up and hit enter. Boom. And then that gives you the same thing again. Now this time in degree mode, let's see. Do we get the same thing? Booyah. Yes, we do. So check that out. If we're going from 
degrees minute second form, aka DMS form, if we're going from that to decimal form, mode don't matter, yo. So we got this, Junks. Easy peasy. Thanks, TI-84. You rock. So let's just summarize this here really quickly, because I want to make sure we get all this mode stuff sorted out, and we're good to go with this. So here we are summarizing, making sure we're paying attention to our mode. Now, if we've got, we're going from degree form to DMS form, and you're in degree mode, make sure that you add that degree symbol. If you're in radium mode, no need to enter the degree symbol. However, if you're going from DMS form to degree form, mode doesn't matter. Boom. Done. Easy peasy, right? Thanks for watching this video. Hope you guys now know how to convert between degree form and DMS form, as well as DMS form, or degrees minute second form, back to degree form. So have fun with your TI-84 graphing calculator as you work through these problems. Thanks for watching, and I'll catch up with you guys again later. Peace out.